Thank you.
I don't know if all of us are all Christians. Are we all Christians? So I want someone to pray for us before we begin. At least let's come into an hour and get into the hands of God before we start. Praise the Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen. Our Heavenly Father, King of Glory, Lord of Lord, the ancient of this, the beauty of the valley, the bright and holy star, the I am that I am. Father, we are here before your presence, King of Glory. We lift up everything that we are going to do here. Father, let your will be done in the name of Jesus. Amen. On our own, we cannot do it. Father, we put our trust in you. Father, for the people that came to empower us, King of Glory, may you bless them the morning in the name of Jesus. Father, you are the God that opened the door and no man can shut. Father, may you open the door for them, about that door that no man can shut in the name of Jesus. As they go, whatsoever they lay their hands on, they shall prosper in the name of Jesus. They shall not know lacking in the mighty name of Jesus. Father, I cover this program today with the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you very much. God bless you, man. So, without wasting much of your time, I want to start, but first of all, I want to introduce myself. My name is Christabel Silver John. So what did I say my name? I represent Ray of Hope Empowerment Foundation, a non-profit organization that is registered with Corporate Affairs Commission. And what we do is to improve the living standard of a common man especially women and children in the areas of education and empowerment. You know, there's something they say, if you teach a man how to fish, he will be able to feed himself for life. But when you give a man fish, what do you do? You keep feeding him forever. And I know that many of us that we don't like that kind of life, that today they give you tomorrow. It's International Women a Widow's Day. The theme is sustainable solutions for women, for widows, financial independence. We want every woman to be financially independent. I don't know if you understand what it means to be financially independent. Thank you very much. 